hello youtubers welcome back to basilos tv today we'll be talking about a very successful and amazing canadian rapper singer songwriter and an actor from toronto who initially gained recognition when he first starred in the teen series titled degrassi the next generation and pursued a rapping career thereafter but before we proceed, please, if you're new to this channel, kindly hit the subscribe button. Do well to turn on that notification bell. Leave a comment below. I subscribe. I'll reply to every comment. And if you have any contributions regarding this video, please leave a comment below. Starting with early life, Aubrey Drake Graham was born in Toronto, Ontario on the 24th of October, 1986. His parents split up when he was only five years of age and Drake lived with his mother in Toronto. His father was a drummer and moved to Memphis after the divorce to find work. Drake's mother was a Jewish and so Drake attended a Jewish day school and had a bar mitzvah ceremony. Drake was often bullied in school for his racial and religious background and eventually dropped out of school. However, when Drake was 15 years old he encountered an acting agent who was the father of a high school friend the agent found drake a role in degrassi next generation which was a teen drama series then drake's character was jimmy brooks a basketball star who became physically disabled after being shot by a classmate little wonder he's still a big fan of basketball today Muscle, Drake has always had a real passion for music and he said Jay-Z was a major inspiration to him. In 2006, Drake released his very first mixtape, Room for Improvement. And a year later, he released his second mixtape and in 2009, Drake released his third titled So Far Good. Further, Lee Wayne and Drake had collaborated on several songs and Drake had also joined one of Wayne's store. Drake signed a recording contract with Young Money Entertainment and in 2010, he released his debut album titled Thank Me Later. Drake has collaborated with some of the best rap artists and hip hop producers in the world, including the likes of DJ Khaled, Eminem, Nicki Minaj, Chris Brown, Rihanna and more. Since then, Drake has released multiple albums, sold millions of copies and gained an incredible net worth. He is one of the most successful hip hop artists worldwide. As of 2020, Drake's net worth is estimated to be roughly around $170 million, making him one of the richest rappers in the world and he's currently signed to Lee Wayne's company Young Money Entertainment. In 2020, Drake released an internet banger titled Tusi Slide. Tusi Slide is a song written by the Canadian rapper from his commercial mixtape Dark Lane Demo Tapes. It was released as a lead single on April 3, 2020 through Republic and Ovo Sound. The song is titled after social media influencer Tusi who had previously helped the song go viral. Interestingly, a video was released alongside the song showing Drake's quarantined due to the COVID-19 pandemic where he also demonstrated to see slide dance in his Toronto mansion. The song debuted at number one on the US Billboard Hot 100 chart, making Drake the first male artist to accomplish this milestone of three number one debuts. Wow, it's amazing. I also want to know about the track's composition. It's a trap song. This slide is a very seductive confection, engineered to cause an internet stir, containing very stuttering symbols. Drake did an amazing job and I think he deserves a lot of accolades. He does really well when composing music. More so, in August 2020, Drake decided to grace our listening pleasure with a banger, a wonderful banger, titled Laugh Now Cry Later. Laugh Now Cry Later is Drake's latest release featuring American rapper Lil Dog. It was released as a lead single from Drake's upcoming sixth studio album titled Satisfied Lover Boy through Republic Records and Ovo Sound on August 14, 2020. The single has a whooping 41 million views so far in just a week. 
However, Drake is a total baller in this Love Now Cry Later. Watch the video, it's really an amazing video. If you haven't seen it, it's a very, very lovely video. It makes a whole lot of sense. I told you guys earlier on that Drake is never wrong. Whenever he's composing music, he knows the right words to choose and how to. He's a very, very good um, songwriter. Thank you very much, amazing viewers, for watching. And uh, please, um, if you have any contribution concerning this video, or if there's anything I've not done or I've not been doing in my previous videos, please kindly leave a comment below. Your comments are highly appreciated. Or if there's any critique about this video, you have anything to say, feel free to say it, please. Let's grow together. Let's grow together, guys. Teach me. I don't know everything. I only know something about everything, not everything about something. And I believe nobody on earth knows everything about everything. We all know something, a little bit about something on a particular topic. So if you have any critique, your critiques are highly welcome, are highly respected. Please, I'll pay very special attention to any um, contributions you have to make about this video thank you for watching and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button to get more involved i really appreciate your time thank you very much you're an amazing youtuber you're an amazing fan thank you